Now we've all done our DNRs, oblique uh, living wills, oblique advanced directives, right here in this documentary. It's your turn. I think this film is my living will. I think whoever sees it, they'll know exactly how I feel about end of life. Some people in this documentary have spoken to us off the record, which we have respected and not used. Some people have spoken of their own experiences. But those who chose to be off record have spoken of the pain that they have felt when watching loved ones with irreversible illnesses. I know that you've had the experience of a woman whom you have loved for almost 27 years contracting an irreversible illness. Would you mind talking about it on camera? Irreversible illness, uh, premature death. Yes, I've seen it up close. I had a friend, a partner for 27 years who was stricken by an illness which developed to an irreversible stage. There was virtually not, nothing to be done. Uh, but she was a fighter. She loved life. She didn't want to die. But she was also clear in her mind. Pain is non-negotiable. Suffering is non-negotiable. Lack of dignity is non-negotiable. So she had a talk with the doctor and was very clear. DNR. Do not resuscitate. She wanted, she had a relatively painless, a quick and peaceful end. I'm glad that she's had such a dignified exit. What's her name? Her name is Malini. This is her. She died at, she was 49 when she died. She is pretty. She's truly pretty. If you, if you have a situation where somebody who's so full of life, as this picture conveys, how did you cope with, on the one hand, that you had to fight for her, and on the other hand, that you had to respect her adult decision. Can, can you tell me if, about that fight inside you? She was a fighter, and I fought with her. In fact, I used to quote those lines from Dylan Thomas, do not go gentle into that dark night, rage, rage against the dying of the light. But there comes a time when you can't fight a futile battle any longer when you don't want to be taken prisoner, when there are other things it becomes about. It's about dignity, it's about not suffering, it's about a life well lived, being rounded off, but also there's always the pain that it's a premature death. <laughs>